All right, and let's turn now and get a look at our forecast closer to home. 23 ABC's meteorologist Brandon Michaels not only tracking the heat, but also the air quality for us as well. Yeah, and we've actually got good news when it comes to the air quality. It's been several days since we've been able to say that. It looks like our smoke will be clearing out here at least uh, quite a bit as we head into the day tomorrow. We're keeping an eye on this uh, little feature right here. You can kind of see that dip in the jet stream. That's an upper level trough that's going to be heading our way, and that's going to supply us with some nice fresh air as we head into the day tomorrow and clear out quite a bit of the smoke that we've been dealing with here. So here's the current smoke projection. You can see most of our valley locations are still dealing with relatively thick smoke here this evening. It's not as bad as it was last week, but it's definitely still unhealthy. Now as we head through time, we're going to see that clear out a little bit through the night tonight, but especially into the day tomorrow as the stronger breezes and the fresh air move in, you see a really diminished picture. Probably still a little bit of haze here and there. We're looking at unhealthy for sensitive groups for our air quality tomorrow, but a big improvement over where we were over the past couple of days. Now with that fresh air moving in, we're also going to see some breezier winds, probably 10 to maybe even some 20 mile per hour gusts here in Bakersfield by tomorrow evening and some even stronger winds in the west side hills, typically breezy in our desert locations as well. As far as our temperatures are concerned, they're going to be pretty close to normal. A little on the warm side, 102 for Jawbone Canyon, 102 for California City, about 100 in Bakersfield tomorrow. So definitely staying warm, but from there, not too much to talk about. Sunny and fairly warm through the forecast could break into a heat wave, but nothing is bad as that heat wave we just came out of where the temperatures were as high as about 107. 70 forecast for our mountain communities. Again, just plenty of sunshine. The smoke's clearing out and temperatures are running a little on the warm side. 100 in the Kern River Valley for tomorrow, but we do see some temperatures that are as cool as the low to mid 80s by the end of the forecast. But I think what we're all really looking forward to is finally being able to breathe a little bit easier once again. Yes, I can't wait to start running outdoors again. It just it hurts if you try to go outside and it's really just not healthy at all. Yeah, I'll pretend to also want to run. <laughs> okay, Brandon, thanks.